it is finally a sunny day out and I get to open up the EcoFlow 220 watt bifacial solar panel. I will be using it to charge up the EcoFlow River 2 Pro power station. Here it is, it is open. It's a really nice case, it's a nice soft gray. Okay, I'm gonna get the zipper open. It is pretty solid and pretty heavy. I believe the spec said 20 pounds. It's every bit of the 20 pounds. So it comes with the cable that is needed to connect it to the power station. The cable has the XT60i on one end and the MC4 cables on the other end. Those will be plugged into the XT60i port on the back of the power station. Get all these cords untied. It is 12.30 now and the sun is directly overhead. So I should be able to get full power or hopefully close to it. The cables are labeled positive and negative, though they're male and female, so you really can't connect them wrong with the EcoFlow cables. So this solar panel is made of four individual panels. Let's get these cables connected. and I'm going to plug that into the back of the power station. Okay, it's climbing. I'm at 177 watts again. Let's see if we can get to the full 220. I'm going to check the app on my phone and let's see what we're getting. Yep, we're right at 177 watts today. One great thing about the app is that it would connect to the power station even when you're not home and on Wi-Fi. So today, that now that I'm outside, it is connected via Bluetooth. In the box, we have the manual. And there's four carabiners. These will attach to the case and to the panel to hold it up. So on the case, I'm seeing there are four latch points. This side is elastic. As I said, this thing is pretty darn heavy. I'm gonna get one connected into the grommet and another one connected into another grommet oh <laughs> it just stands all on its own so that's um pretty nice see if i get any better input now nope it dropped because the sun is basically overhead i do have solar angle finder that should work so let's see how it works i've never used it before Okay, so the perfect angle should be when the shadow is 
centered, which is basically almost flat. So I'm not sure how helpful that would be with this case. I don't know if the case is capable of this angle. Yeah, I don't think it's possible to get such a low angle without propping something under this. So I'm going to use the box. It is almost lying down. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that helps. Oh, look at that. I got the angle spot one with the angle finder. And we're up to 181 watts of input. If I remember correctly, the manual says between 12 noon and 1 p.m. it should be flat, which is the time today, or between 12 and 2, something like that. So usually I guess I would just leave it flat if it's midday and use the case to make the angles at the other times of the day. Right now I have an input of 160 watts. It's been fluctuating. I am in full sun, but it is a little bit hazy. So we'll see how that works. I have charged a power station with two individual 100 watt panels that were connected in parallel. And even then I never get anything over the 100 watts. So this 220 watt panel is just perfect. It gets over the 100 watts easily and it says it would take 42 minutes to charge the power station at the current 158 watt input. It's at 83% in climbing. So not too bad if I were hanging out on a sunny day. I can keep this charged all day long. I could also, with 159 watts input, use it to pass through charge other items. So I could have other items charging while this is staying powered in the sun. So far, I am really liking this panel. It is heavy. It is definitely heavy. You'd be carrying this by itself, but otherwise it is performing as expected and it is capturing the sun's rays and powering up the power station. As heavy as it is, it will be traveling with me when I go camping or do any kind of outdoor activity. I 100% recommend the EcoFlow 220 watt bifacial solar panel. What's cool about it is that it gets rays from the sun, captures them in the front, as well it gets what's reflected from the back of the solar panel. And the amount that it gets from the back is dependent on the surface that it's on. The details can be found on EcoFlow's website. I also love <laughs> the power station. That River 2 Pro is really great. It charges really fast and it is easy to take with you places. The combination is sold on EcoFlow's website as well on Amazon, and I will put links to all of these items in the description below.